What is up guys, this is Space Grip the Knight, here to bring you the history of a bot that was a building foundation to the idea of life. This bot dominated the battlefield and was loved by many players across the world. Ladies and gents, we have been spotted by the robot, the myth, the legend, Gary. <clears throat> the, the other one, the, the, yeah, yeah, that one, Gary. So, what is so special about this type of bot, and why was this bot one of the most lovable types of bots in Planet Robocraft? Before we get started, I want to introduce you to the amazing and supernatural Stalnor, who will be joining me today on presenting this video for you. Hello. So, without further ado, let's get started. Let's start with this origin. Gary was born shortly after June 19th, 2014, when a community was asked to create bots to fill practice mode. A lot of contributions was made, but none of them was Gary. That leads to the conclusion that Gary might have been made by extraterrestrial beings tampering with the game. Or, more likely, it was a developer from Figure. A list was supposed to have been released on all the practice bots and their creators, but that was never done. Gary was different. Compared from other bot designs, Gary had a name banner that displayed his name in all caps. He was also equipped with two Japanese badges on the side of his bot as well as some enemy radars. He had personality and also a temper for rage quitting. If you followed him around or stopped him from moving, he would eventually self-destruct. Gary was never a starter bot, but was often mistaken as well. He was the bot that you would upgrade to become the very best that no other bot ever was. Many players created build videos just for Gary, while others would praise him for being a legend that he was. The spirit of Gary showed us that playing a small cruiser could be fun, and that having a small Gary-ish bot and building upon it and making it better was the true essence of Robocraft. It was all fun and games, but Robocraft was evolving. Hey boss! Gary was removed from practice mode during the release of the Dawn of the Megabots update on February 18th, 2015. It was a silent deletion as players that played practice mode started to realize that Gary was no more. Please come home cause I miss you Gary. Gary, come home. Gary come home. He was replaced with new starter bots and life in Robocraft wasn't the same. Players pressed F and paid their respects as a legend had fallen. In his honor, players have made a Mega Gary to commemorate his success and to praise Gary for his creation. But Gary doesn't stop there. Wheels have been obsolete for a long time and 3M decided enough is enough. Wheels will be revived. Players will fight back. Gary will reign supreme in the new generation of Robocraft. Thanks to the fast and formidable update. Gary should be viable, and Gary will finally reign supreme once again. So that pretty much wraps it up for this video. I want to thank Stalnor for helping me out with finding all the Garyful information needed to create this video as well as voicing in this video. Click the annotation to watch his Gary build video where he not only builds Gary, but he also has some funny commentary defending Gary for who he truly is. Next video I have cooking up is the history of Triforcing, which is going to be very long, intensive, and informational. So really, prepare your eyes. This video will be about 15 to 20 minutes long. I would split it, but um, yeah, it doesn't it doesn't cope well when I'm trying to split that kind of information. It, there is no way to do part one and part two. So you guys will get to enjoy the whole entire 15 to 20 minutes. Yeah. I want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for all your robo needs. And until next time, this is Space Crypt the Night and Stolnura logging out. We will catch you guys later.